How many of you would like to go outside, strip down, bare ass naked, and bask in the sunshine? You'd like it, wouldn't you? Come on, Packy, tell the truth. How about if I told you it would be good for your health? Really good for your health. Might be interested then too, huh? Yeah. A woman that works for a pharmaceutical firm I met the other day at a party. I asked her how come all the doctors recently are advising that we take vitamin D. And here's what she told me. These eeny beeny little things crawling in the mud million and million and million of years ago, our ancestors finally figured out how to get out of that mud, but they were around the equator. They were where the sun was shining and they could grow really well. So, although it did take millions of years, they finally got out of there and got on land and then figured out how to stand up and then it became us and it was around the equator. Then we started to wander. Some of us went north, some of us went south, and where the sun didn't shine quite as much as it did around the equator. And then we got lighter. We didn't have as much melanin in our skin, and we became blondes, and way up by the North Pole, we became very light again. So now the doctors tell us, oh, well, you better take vitamin D. That's the sunshine vitamin, and you're not getting enough of it. But they don't tell you, go naked, go outside and get some sunshine. You know, if they did, there would be another doctor behind them that would say, hey, that's not good for you. You get out in the sunshine and you get melanoma, and it could kill you. If you're lucky, they catch it and they burn it off. So should we or shouldn't we get naked and run around in the sunshine? It's a dilemma. On one hand you should, the other hand you shouldn't. I don't know, maybe we should just take our vitamin D, avoid getting arrested, and be safe. That's a good plan. Well, forget it. I'm sorry I even brought the whole subject up. Never mind. Here's Grace Bodle at the helm of Arrows. Saturday went out practicing and had a wonderful sail on the bay and I was on board too. Looky there. When Bill decided that everything on board was where it belonged and everything was ship shape, he came back and took the helm for a bit. Somebody got the photograph that I did this painting from. I think it was the first day that Arrows went sailing. It, made, it might have been Jerry Ramsey and his powerboat that went out to get some pictures of it. And I took advantage of the photograph and did this painting of Arrows the first day.